The Nine Worlds is a no-weapon zone, strictly enforced since the riots. So you want me to disarm in the middle of a war zone? No, you've just got to consent to the standard deactivation procedure before entry. I'll transmit the encrypted safety lock bite code, which will effectively freeze all your weapons. Sensors at the exit will automatically reactivate everything you're carrying when you leave. Here you go. Thanks for your cooperation. Come on in. Time again for a dark bullet! In the bullseye today, Chairman Dumier of the WTO. Welcome, Chairman. I admire what you've done for the world community. Hi, Brent. You've proven once and for all that a sound economic infrastructure establishes confidence, trust, and a good life for everyone. Why demean yourself by negotiating with a religious cult? Well, Her Holiness is a woman who... I'm embarrassed for you, Chairman. Seriously, you're kneeling before con artists. I'm turning red. Look at me. I'm turning red just thinking about it. I'm a diplomat, right? Her Holiness and I? Take my advice and call the whole thing off. Encourage them and you just make the church into a bigger problem. Mark my words. I'm afraid that's all the time we have. A pleasure, as always. This has been another talk. Bullet, bullet, bullet. How's the search coming? I've made some discoveries. I think I'm finally in the right place. What's the passenger's name? My instructions forbid me to say. Maybe I could help if I knew who it was. You've been very helpful already. My computer analyzed the transceiver in your temporal bone and found some interesting data files. Those are encrypted files. I found the key some time ago. I will be using your eyes and ears to gather more data. As compensation, if you need a pilot for any reason, I will be available. I don't like being spied on. Your notions of privacy are old-fashioned. It was a love of privacy that brought on the collapse. A love of secrets, plans, and personal possessions. I still don't like being spied on. Perhaps I'm too aggressive, but a society in which everyone understands everyone else is something I think we all should strive for. How about I bug your chopper and make this learning process go both ways? Very soon we will be connected. A great advance will change what it means to be human, and there will be no further need to conceal information. But that world is not yet here. May you be shielded from chaos. Alex D, you're the last one to arrive. I suppose that like the others, you're after my laboratory in the gateway to JC Dental. Your tracer Tong. I see that Dr. Nassif didn't exaggerate about your mental acuity. Yes, I'm Tong. I suppose you will be wanting some answers. You may have already guessed that your true name is Alex Denton. Dr. Nassif was telling the truth. I'm a clone of JC Denton. With a few postnatal recombinations, yes. But our work has moved away from clones. So this gateway, I can use it to find JC Denton? Yes. Beneath the ruins of the Black Gate, JC constructed a portal to his secret base in Antarctica. Only descendants of the Denton cell line can go through. However, the facility is already in the hands of the Templars. Did the Templars use the portal? How could they unless one of the other trainees... Unless the Templars have already convinced one of you to go through the gate and murder JC. Exactly. At a minimum, they have a highly placed spy who has torn apart our organization starting with Chicago. What else do you know about this spy? Whoever it is also helped the Templars kidnap Her Holiness during a meeting with the Panzerworks Union. They are holding her at the Black Gate Laboratory. I am going to give you a code to a secret entrance, which is in a room on the second floor of the East Tower, 2521. Look for a keypad hidden behind some crates. For all you know, I'm a Templar myself. Then Apostle Corps has already lost everything. Rescue Her Holiness. Save the summit for the sake of both factions. They will help you against the Templars. You will need the help of the WTO and order just a little while longer. I understand. Here's something to give you an edge. A biomod infusion. It isn't much, but it's all I managed to grab on my way out of the laboratory.
A member of the Order. Are you with the Summit? Certainly not. I live here in Trier. Seekers here don't care very much for this notion of a Summit. Why not? We have heard Luminan Saman's call for a return to Scripture. In this shard, we read the Scripture, the original word of Her Holiness. Not what she says for the camera today, or tomorrow, or two weeks ago. What's the difference? What's the difference? That's exactly the attitude that opens the door to tyranny in a free state. Remembering only what was said on the last talk show. What's the value of a free press when attention spans are so short? I was just curious about the summit. Sorry to interrupt. Her Holiness and Chairman Dumier are making a business deal. It may bring money, it may bring power, but it won't bring balance into the lives of ordinary people. You sure you're locked up? Nora Guevara has been in my family for three generations. I've been locking up since I was a boy. I told you, those weapon mods are stolen. They don't belong in a display case on the side of the road. The last place the Saudis will look is the Nora Guevara shop. I am a respected businessman. I'll just be glad when we can make the drop for the Omar. My mind opens more each day to the true path. You must be in town for the summit. We're having a private conversation. The second hire of the police event won't do any good.
Pentalux. It's not just a name, it's a commitment. To security, to safety, and most of all, to the community. Our facility in Trier provides more than half the population of the city with the jobs they can be proud of. The production of bots, from security grade to military level, helping to keep the world safe. Right now we are expanding production, so we're looking for new faces. You might be the next vice manager in charge of servo receptors or armor arc welder technician 3. Submit your application today. Time again! For the first time in decades, meteorologists are detecting a dissipation in nanite swell 11. In the history of the 14 nanite pollution clouds globally, no natural disintegration has ever been observed. Five years ago, there was a significant shift in swell 9, but that was caused by El Nino. Most predictors seem to indicate that all of the nanological clouds were permanent after effects from environmental damage done in the wake of the collapse. This unexpected change is great news for the citizens of Old Cairo, who had grown accustomed to the permanent haze which was suspected by many to be the cause of the higher incidence of certain diseases in the Medina. <laughs> 